Harmony opened its doors in 2000 with a focus on STEM education and quickly made its mark. They're knocking the cover off the ball. They are teaching reading, writing, and arithmetic, and they're doing it at a level that is difficult to improve upon. I would describe Harmony as a very student-oriented school. Nicholas Gonzalez is a Harmony teacher with a unique perspective. He graduated from the school in 2010. Everything that I've seen um, as a student, as a teacher, as a student mentor, they start from, from the foundation of uh, making sure that the student gets whatever it is that they need to get out of the program first. Brandon Okafor can attest to that. The little boy who used to get up at 5 a.m. and catch three city buses to get to school every day is now a hydrogeologist at AECOM, a Fortune 500 global engineering design firm. Coming here put things in a, a bigger perspective. Three, two, one, liftoff of Space Shuttle Discovery. Perhaps no one understands thinking beyond one's limits better than astronaut turned STEM educator Dr. Bernard Harris. To focus an educational institution to reach the economically disadvantaged uh, in communities around this city and in other places um, was, was great. I mean, it was. Uh, um, incredibly uh, uh, foresightful. And Clay, I've cycled the circuit breaker on the SEU The future one. of this world requires that we have knowledgeable people in STEM. The Harmony family is making its mark in the halls of academia and beyond, while staying true to the mission of charter schools by sharing best practices with others. With YES Prep and KIPP Academies and the Harmonies, um, you see them all working together. And, um, and how do I define success? I mean, they've got the numbers. You look at their graduation rates, you look at their test rates, you look at the acceptance to all the major universities. Currently, uh, more than 50% of our you know, graduates end up in STEM fields. I think that's, to me, is, is, is a huge success uh, because the national average is about uh, 15, 17%. This is not just about you know, making sure that African Americans and Latinos and Hispanics are educated. This is about uh, how do we preserve our livelihood as a nation. It is very important that we continue to grow because we get so many thousands of applications every year. Everywhere we want to open schools, parents are lining up to come to Harmony.